Hello everyone, welcome back. I want to take a minute to talk to you about these uh, Lancer magazines. Um, I have quite a few of them. Um, one of them in particular, I, I just realized like a few minutes ago, um, has a, a, a round grommet in the back. And um, it's, uh, it looks like it's at the 10 spot position. So I'm guessing the purpose of that, of that metal grommet is so that you can run like a screw or something through it and, and pin the magazine in the, in the number 10, you know, in the 10 position. Um, you know, for states where, you, where you're limited to 10 rounds in the magazine, um, you know, and that, obviously that's, that's not a concern for me uh, in my particular state. However, it did follow me up here today um, because that, that, that um, uh, grommet that goes through the back of the magazine, um, it kind of sticks out a little bit into, into the magazine. And uh, it, I don't recall it ever having done this before, but today as the follower was coming up, it uh, the back of the follower right got stuck on that grommet and uh, you know I, I was shooting, doing a shooting drill and uh, you know I went to pull pull the trigger um, and basically you know basically there was nothing there and, and I, I knew it wasn't a jam I knew it was something kind of weird so I just dropped the magazine put another one in you know um, uh, you know uh, ran the bolt and I just kept working uh, and then later on when I looked at it I saw that the follower had gotten stuck on that grommet. And I, and I got kind of pissed off. I realized what it was. I took out my knife and I popped that grommet out. Um, you know, I mean, getting rid of it will fix the problem. Um, so I just want to make you guys aware that that some Lancer mags, not all of them, because I looked at my other ones, my other ones didn't have it. Some some uh, Lancer magazines have this grommet in the back here, and even if you don't want to screw through it or anything like that, it can still catch the follower. So you you want to get rid of that grommet. Um, you know, just, just pop it out with a knife or, you know, with, some, with, a, with a thin razor or something. Yeah, you, it, it's a little hard to get underneath there. It has to actually work to get underneath it. Um, I, I did scratch up the magazine. I mean, not that I care, but, um, you know, it's kind of hard to get it out there without scratching up the magazine. I mean, it's going to happen. Um, you know, like I said, not that I care. And, 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 you know, when I first looked at it, I looked, I, said, I looked at it and said, wow, this is like a new condition. How did this magazine fail? And then I, I saw that and I saw where it was stuck and I said, okay, I, I knew what it was. So um, if you if you use Lancer magazines, uh, take a look at them and look out for that that grommet. Okay, even if you have not had a problem with it, because I've not had a problem with it up until today. Um, you know, who know, I might have dropped it at some point. You know, during uh, one of my drills and it got pushed through a little bit deeper. So you know, even if you're not having a problem with it, you may have a problem at some point. So you want to get rid of that grommet unless you anticipate on moving to a state where you're limited to 10 rounds. Um, so, so, so get rid of that grommet so you don't get stuck like in the middle of one of your exercises. Um, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it. If you're not a member of the channel, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.